Hello everyone, Marek Mulajic here and welcome to another video and in this video I want to talk about, no not the hard drives, no, <laughs> I want to talk about the cables. Now, does it make any difference what cable you're going to use? Now I'm talking about a USB-A to USB-C cable, so they all have USB-C here, okay. I'm using these uh, two portable SSDs which are supposed to be giving us reading and writing speeds of about half a gigabyte a second, 500 megabytes a second, roughly. So I would expect 450 to 500, okay? And I'm actually going to test just one of them, but just to show you, I've got two here, but they're exactly the same. And I've got two different cables here. And I know that in some situations cable does matter, but if it's just a USB-A to USB-C, USB 3. Point something, by the way, okay, uh, both are the same. Uh, what difference does it make, right? A thought. Well, you're up for a surprise. <laughs> I'm going to show you. So what I've got in here is, this, this is the original Samsung cable in this case, the one that came with this Samsung portable SSD. Uh, they're amazing, by the way. Uh, I've been using them for many years and they're fantastic. They never let me down and brilliant performance and build and so on. Maybe I'll talk about them on a different video. And then I've got another cable, which is from a different manufacturer. I won't mention any names, <laughs> but it's one of the major brands. And I thought I would get exactly the same performance, but maybe so who's, which one is going to be faster? Which one's going to be slower? Okay. So for now, I will tell you that there will be a difference in speed. Now, they both the same length, just so you know. So it's not like the longer cable will be slower. Uh, maybe, but they're the same length. Okay. So let's test them and let's see what speeds we're going to get. And are we really going to get I would say at least 450 megabytes a second. I wouldn't expect it to hit the 500, but may, if it's just below, like if it's, say, no more than 10% slower, so if it's at least 450, then I'll be happy. And just to clarify, uh, I'm using uh, Surface Pro 6, which has a USB-A, so that's why I'm using USB-A cable. My Surface Pro 6 doesn't have USB-C, but still, even with the USB-3, USB-A on my Surface Pro, this should still be hitting almost 500 megabytes per second. So let's test them and let's find out. Let's see which one's going to win. Hello, hello, it's me again. Who would have thought that you would get such a vast difference in speed from two USB cables, you know? So in this case, I would definitely say it does pay to, get, to use the original cable or get a proper one, a good one. So it does make a difference and it's Unbelievable the difference it is, you know, the US, the uh, Samsung cable is 10 times faster and you're getting the actual speeds. Who would have thought? So I'm going to stick to the Samsung cable. I'm going to throw the other one away and I'll stick to this. Right. So Samsung wins in this case. Yay. Okay. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you find it informative. 
Uh, I'm Marek Milacek from MarekMilacek.com and I hope to see you again on another video. Um, maybe a test of one of these guys, who knows? Okay. Maybe. Let me know if you have any questions and leave it in the comments and I'll see you soon. Ta-da!